Guys, I'm telling y'all, it never fails. What's yeah, up? We got a brand new trip to the thrift, and birds are chirping on the thrift signs, man. That is a, a blessed omen, if I say so. Also, international shipping to everywhere in the world, worldwide, international, is available on the website. Just felt like announcing that, and sorry if the prices are high. I, I don't ship to, to Albania, so I don't know how much it costs, but we'll see and we'll work it out, all right? But anyways, speaking of working out, Kinky is looking like a mobster right now, like he's about to work out someone's jaw, looking like an enforcer, Russian mob. Y'all know what it is. But uh, yeah, we're gonna hit the thrifts today, find some cool stuff to keep, flip, rock, everywhere, in betwixt. It's a brand new trip to the thrift and we in this bit. All right, y'all, we're in here. Skirt, skirt. Hey, we got one thing thus far, man. It's been a little minute since we found a hat. We got that Ace Time. Holy die. It is Ace Town, Texas, Braveswood, baby. Houston Rockets. Even though it's the Astros. Stupid. Dude, I just like mentally farted right there. But um, very cool size. Y'all know. Y'all know the size. Seven. Seven. Exactly. So I'm gonna throw that in card. They got some American pride right here. Seven, Seven. bucks, the eagle, the flag, and then the five dollar constitutional convention. I don't think I'm getting either of these, but you know, they're semi-cool, so. I'm semi-hard. What? What you got, bruh? You got this, uh... Nordica? Nordica crazy color. Nice mustard, clean color scheme. And, and then uh, what you got right here? Beautiful Nautica? Nautica okay. Nautica on but, the uh, back. The price is, uh, absolutely insane. What's the price? What's the price? Oh, oh my god. god. Prices, prices going up. Woo. Tripping. Personal file. Tripping. So this little windbreaker right here. Florida State Seminoles. This is like when Pro Player entered the early 2000s, okay? Little Pro Player insignia. Oh, okay. I like this. Hey, and I like what I like. I said I like what I like. Check it out, man. The Fila Vintage Windbreaker. Navy and white. It's like waves crashing on a beach. Oh, that is clean, man. Majestic. Two birds, one bat. St. Louis Cardinals. Oh my god, bro. That's an that's an acquisition. What they yaxing? Seven. Seven. Look at this. You got the Nautica when I'm gone off the Molly Piss colorway. 15 though? What? No. I don't do Molly either, just to clarify. Pupils dilated much? I'm gonna tell my kids this was Tommy Hill figure. Hey bro, I got you something, man. Look, that completes the fit, huh? Can look like a housewife who runs on a bi-weekly basis. <laughs> I think this is perfect for you. Perfect. Oh wow, look how cozy this is. Chaps Ralph Lauren. Five dollars, my second favorite type of bone, the herringbone texture. Oh, look at the crest. Oh. I need some help pronouncing this, man. Lazarne. Lazarne? Lazarne. Lazarne is money, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right, let's go, man. As soon as we started getting cozy in this store, we just started to score. Look at it. One bird, one bat. That's a nice, uh, Un, unscandalous ratio, but you have the St. Louis Cardinals. I love the font selection, the neck, the ribboning, the cufflets, everything is going on. What's the price? Seven. Seven. Oh, how delicious. Check out this, this other crew neck. You got the Salisbury steak sweater. Oh, no, <laughs> no. How, how old do you think that lady was? Uh, I would say like 53. 53. Hey man, we got recognized by a 53 year old woman. Nah, I mean, all up in the thrift. Yes, man. Uh, and another lady too. It was it was a couple uh, silver foxes it, coming out there hiding hole. You dig? Trying to <laughs> munch on us. But anyways, man, we got some cool things. And I don't think I mentioned it at the beginning, but my website is Thrift Type of Vintage. I'm sure all you guys already know that, but shameless self advertisement, bruh. I'm a boss, so I go off. No, I like to Good lord, guys. We just pulled up to the next spot. I park like absolute booty meat. But it's because I'm like Moses parting the Red Seas of these giant vehicles. Anyways, I also forgot to mention, Duck Head is the best head, all right? Y'all remember that. But without further ado, thrift store number two. I know I did not enter this premises only to get blue balled. Look at this. Look at this. Look at all the jersey selection. They got legends. Ray Lewis in the black colorway. Youth XL? No! <laughs> Peyton Manning? What is he? A Youth XL? No! All of these Youth XLs. Tripping. Tripping. Right in time for the Super Bowl? Yes, sir. What you got right there? Concussion protocol? Yes, sir. Shit. Not gonna protect you from anything. I wear size 7 and 1 8s. You don't think this will fit? Perfect. 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 Per
first time and open. He's got it! That's a Bengal touch! Okay. So now that I've contracted lice, that's always a, a positive, but I'm definitely gonna get this helmet right here just because I always wanted these as a kid. So, I mean, if you guys got a child and y'all want this, thrift type vintage, or if you're an adult and you wanna pretend to be Joe Burrow, that works too. Um, Kinky also found this Steelers helmet right here. Very cool. And then speaking of Kinky, if there's one thing he gets, he gets that cats. I get that cat. But seriously, man, this store has been dry as hell. The only thing that I'm grabbing clothing wise, I think is this Chevy T. New school, but still cool. I like the graphic. Two bucks and a couple helmets. Let's run it. Okay guys, so uh, yeah, the last store got two helmets. That's about it. But now we're going to Family Thrift on Hillcroft. <sighs> Let's find some more divine finds. Let's get it. Is that redundant? Find some more divine find. Whatever, dude. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Here we go again, guys. You wear it, you find it. Duck head is the best head. You heard me. That's quack tastic. Guys, check out this thing right here, man. Again, you don't have to smoke the cigs to get the merch. Marlboro, country store, baby. Full cow leather collar. Nice lumberjack plaid draws interior. And then the back. Nice little Marlboro leather hit. Now that's swell right there. Metallica. Banty. All over printed. It is a, a 2008 size small. And then speaking of small, this is a weird ass font, but it is on the champion frame. The LSU T grays, bruh. Oh boy, oh boy. Polo t-shirt. Polo draws. Now Not we'll make me take, take this polo off. Look at that little. Extra hard to get this out. What's in your hand right there? Oh! Yeah, it's the same jacket as last time. Another live one. It is? I don't know, bro. This got the double, the double dual wheel to bro, chase. Good lord, that thing is nice as hell. Size large, vintage Nike, gray delicious. Oh my lord, I came over here to see what that was. What you got right there? See, even the thrift animated creatures are finding a way into the the uh, Winter Olympics right there, man. Joe period brand. Damn, then you found the Adidas too? Bro, hey, you rock it, I don't you find it. You don't discriminate? Uh, don't. Look, you got another one behind you. Yes, sir. Right, you know, Kinky might've got a little Nike. But I got some Nike too. No, but seriously, this is a beautiful grayscale Nike piece, man. Size medium right there. But what's even better is they try to ruin the piece from being resold. It's that sample on the back. Ooh. Allegedly, evidently, I mean, it might be, this is handwritten, but this is, I mean, they wrote this in a really cool font, so respect. Um, I think it might be a designer's handwriting, but then also, we find so many red birds, but it's about time, man, we have a beautiful day and have some bluebird representation. You got the Blue Jays of Taranto, Canada. Hey, all my Canadians out there, you know, go ahead. It's only $5 more for y'all shipping and to Mexico, but if it starts getting overseas, then Lord knows, I don't know, man. Albanians, I'm sorry. Don't let them fool you. They're not the Buckeyes. They're the weed leaves. And you know the weed sticky. All right, Kinks, what you got, man? Uh, uh, I'm about to earn my title back. Uh, Crew Neck King, yes, you coming sir. for the you coming for the throne? Yes, sir. First of all, we got the nice. Uh oh. Canada geese. Canada geese. Yes, sir. Then the beautiful. Wow. Ohio State. Bird. Hold on, let me sniff the rose. Smells like used clothes. What else? Then we got Notre Dame. <sighs> Logo athletic. Got the Dukes up. Then we got uh -oh. State. Uh oh, University of Pedophilia. Uh oh, what else? And then we got that hometown heat. Hometown. Oh my <laughs> god, bruh. H Town, hold it down. The Houston Rockets, and it even has the light blue for the contemporary jerseys. You hear me? And then also for the Oilers gear, too. Hey, I got a serious question for you, bro. Yeah. So this uh this this shirt got got a little race car driver. It says Chili Bowl. Yeah. You think they racing in Chili? It looks like it. So confirmed. Yes. Bro, this is what I come to the thrift for. Forty-four cent drows. Hey, all I know is deep down, we're all nothing but slugs. Oh, that's a humdinger. Hey, my best self is myself when I accessorize. 
Look at the print. What is that? Like abstract grapes? You have the Toro Vintage Snappleberry? Man, this really does have a nice, unique print. Cop. Kings found that US soccer jersey. Looks like they, they hit a sly tackle on a urinal, bro. That is disgusting. Or they got sucked till they peed. She gonna suck dick till I pee. Carhartt? Hold on. Oh, it actually is. God damn. Bro, this thing is beautiful. I rarely ever see the Sherpa sheep line. Size medium car hearts. What you got, bruh? Jesus. Oh, that full mohawked out. I didn't even see this from a distance. I was like, man, that looking, that looking like a half pipe on his head, bro. <laughs> we got that dent. Another one, 1999, St. Louis. And another one, another I'm telling y'all, we have all the gear. Whoever wins, we, bro, that looks Nike. Yup. Nike boys with the dirty neck. Look at this, another Nike, Nike boys, boys, we don't, don't do, do three strikes. strikes. Except it's the Dallas Cowboys remixed rendition. It even has the nice, uh, the, the nice, what would you call that? Um, laser etched, laser cut, CNC routed, <laughs> Nike check in the zipper, double X, um, pro line on the back. Damn, this thing is whole. I, I, this really alleviated me of my thrift plasticity. What? Bruh. Here we go, man. Find of the day. Yeah. That Viagra racing. Marcus Martin. Bruh, used to be a heart medication. Now it's a dick pill. Now they slinging vac vaccinations. Bruh, the Pfizer. Good Lord, the back is hard too. Oh, and it's showing off a little tailpipe. Oh, I don't, I don't know if I need Viagra. I'm feeling a little, feeling a little something, man. My pants getting a little tight around the groin. Okay, let me stop, but this shirt. Bro, this is hard, man. They got that free Boosie merch. They call me bad ass, and I punish you. You ain't my equal, we ain't people, I ain't wanna get. Okay, it's getting late in the day, but we have proceeded to yet another store. Hillcroft has always came through, but we still are out sifting for just a little bit more sauce. So let's turn up the heat, get it to a nice boil, and hopefully find some crazy shit. Let's go. Oh my. my. Dick. Dick. Little kinky twist. The Grateful Dead. Looks like they ripped the tag off of it. It is double stitched, so not super, super old, but this is super cold. Paul playing two stees. The whole world is a radish. My guys, we're getting it out here. This is a beautiful, beautiful shirt. Okay, the Kingster got one at the last spot. I got one up in here. I'm telling y'all. Oh, the Houston. Love for game. Pocket Rockets, old school logo. So gorgeous, so gorgeous. You ain't winning, bro, if you ain't twinning. Vintage, oh. Pepsi. Hey, these go with our Travis Scott fours as well. Come on, man. You might as well give it up. I'm the crew neck king and ain't nothing you can do about it. God, damn, look at these grails. Big check, big Cincinnati. And then in hand, old school Wrangler made in America, baby. That rusty sweat. That's a working man right there. Hey, forget Calvin Klein's. He rocking the couch potatoes, bro. 44 cent draws. But you said single stitched? The grayscale? Homer Simpson? Don't, don't! Oh, all right, guys. We got an actual grail in the house. But unfortunately, someone uh, went to arts and crafts with it, all right? They whipped out the scissors and uh, straight demolished the vintage Single stitch kiss tee. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Double sided. What I'm man. excited. <laughs> this is. Boy, ain't no way, bro. You still rock that? Definitely, man. Shaw, hella collar. I'll bro, I'll rock a bacon all day. That's it can't even stay on the hanger. Oh, this man. is disrespectful. This is disrespectful. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. I don't feel like counting, so I bought a money counter. Got him. <laughs> There's some, uh, some nice tings in the form of uh <laughs> in the form of future policing 1990 the robocop movie MTV, film mtv, MTV 2t and then you have yes dear yes dear yes dear the stressed out chicago bear with the golden grill in mouth this is really really tough and then of course the gang no formal formal Bro, someone who worked at the movies just quit. This is grail grabbing. 
Here's another one. Another one. All right. So we're heating up now. Dude, we just had to lay everything out. Scorpions Worldwide Live. Star Wars Episode 1, Arachnophobia. You have The Alarm Single Stitch. You have Timmy South Park. You have Sigmund in the Sea Monsters. And then there's a Green Day. There's a Green Day tee as well on the giant Made in USA hard ass graphic. Bro, can I get this up for the first one? Stupid hard, of course. All right, forget anything else. This is the real relic. The Nickelback Bam tee. Bruh, legends. Oh, the Wrangler NASCAR? Come on, baby. You kidding me? Got like the the Rock Hopper penguins? Wait. <laughs> oh, let's get it on the Nat Geo tag. What? All right, last and not least, one for the personal collection. Guys, the Houston Astros, old school slash new school now. Colorway, circa 1990, has the Astrodome on it. The shirt goes dumb. I love the font choice, the drop shadow. Whew. It's been a it's been a swell day, swell day. And all right guys, so we are back. I actually just got done editing this entire video. Sorry about the echo, it is what it is. Empty room, I need to decorate. But um, yeah, hands down the best find and biggest disappointment of the day, the kiss tee. Now I just threw this on, I was gonna wear it for the conclusion just to show how truly stupid and sad it is that this got chopped up. However, this smells like an illegal gambling operation, like, just smells like something back room bingo hall or some bullshit. So yeah, this definitely smells, but I am gonna get my friend to um, to him and add a neck to this dude and then probably we'll keep it in the personal because it would have been such a clutch fit on your boy. And I can't have my clavicle showing like that. No, sir. Now as for some of the other tees, the Star Wars shirt, this is an easy, cool little $40. We're just gonna do some of the some of the value of these crazy tees in the last store. The Scorpions, this is easily like $125 bond tee right here, double-sided. I'm excited. Worldwide tour. This shirt is awesome. This alarm tee, I couldn't find a comparable price on, but it is very, very cool. The Grateful Dead, guys, we don't even gotta run up the price because y'all know I'm keeping this. See, thrifting ain't just about the Skrilla for me. It's about finding some one of one gems for the person aisle. This Sigmund in the Sea Monsters tee, I honestly thought would be worth a lot more. It's like an $80 tee all day, every day, but also just, bro, it just looks hella hard, bruh. And these throwback like tees are just, they're just the shit, okay? Now, South Park Timmy T, a cool 75 buckarooskies on this dude. The RoboCop 2T, y'all saw the price, about 125. That's what it's listed for, okay? I couldn't find a, a sold rendition of some of these items because they are rare. And then the Arachnophobia. This is easily a $100 T. It says eight legs, two fangs, and an attitude, okay? And then obviously the Green Day Nimrod T is like a $250 T-shirt easily but Kinky loves that band and sometimes, bro, when you're thrifting with the homies, I'd rather my homie has something dope than me make 200 bucks, you dig? Because uh, every twice in a while, bro, you find those items that are special and personal to you and of course, that's what we need to have in our collections. So I really did <laughs> up a check in this video in terms of things that I can sell and I do sell on my website, thriftinvintage.com. Check it out if you guys want anything. These items aren't probably gonna be listed the exact day this video releases. Just because I got done editing, it's kinda late, I wanna chill. It takes like four hours to edit these damn videos. So please, like these shits if you liked them. Follow the Thrift Heaven Instagram to know when new gear drops on the website. It might be tomorrow or the next day. Just follow the Instagram to know when the drops occur. And we do have that worldwide shipping on all newly listed items. So if you guys are from another country, want some gear, um, go ahead, check out the site. And some of the items don't have international shipping if they were listed a long time ago. I just haven't gone back and added it yet. So bear with me, be patient. And until next time, man, thank you guys yet again for watching. It's been another trip to the thrift. It's your host with the most, all oh, can too, signing out saying peace and love. I'll see y'all very soon. Subscribe, turn on notifications, and uh, we'll be back before you know it. Peace. Killing these songs, leaving a bloody life by roosting. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get.